October 2009, the Amur River in the far wild east of Russia. Three men set out on a fishing trip. <laughs> it's the kind of trip they've made many times before. Only this time is different. <laughs> This time, they never return. A year later, the bodies of two of the men are found, or what's left of them. Long dead, apparently drowned. The third body is never recovered. Over the years, there have been many rumors of disappearances, deaths, and monsters connected with the Amur River. But it's impossible to get any more information. It's as if there's something in the water that they don't want the outside world to know about. So I've had nothing concrete to go on, until now. Russia is a place I've never been to before. It's the largest country in the world, and the Amur is the world's 10th longest river. At 2,700 miles, it's nearly twice as long as the Colorado. The region is home to some of the largest land predators, tigers and bears. But what's in the river? Legend has it, the river was carved out by a huge black dragon as it dragged its body from the sea. And something still lurks in its depths, killing fishermen to this day. I want to find out what it is. Oh, more bubbles here. That is a oh, big fish. After weeks of searching, I finally caught my first Kaluga. So this is it, the Kaluga sturgeon of the Amur River. Now, this is big by normal freshwater fish standards, but by the standards of what this fish can potentially grow to, this is a small one but I've never been so happy and relieved to find a fish alive. 